What's up, Fallout friends? I figured I'd make this video because if any of you are like me, you don't want to watch a whole complete playthrough to figure out what you got to do inside this place. So I figured I'd make a video that just covers the key elements of what you need to do to complete this quest because it really is not that hard. It's just a couple of things you need to make sure you pay attention to. So here we go. So. While you're roaming around in the vault, you're going to notice you're going to come across two rooms that are full of water that you can swim around in and check out what's going on and look through stuff. In those rooms, you're going to find a dead body, probably looks like a ghoul's dead body, and just as legs are sticking out, you want to click on that dead body and you're going to find the security terminal password in one of the rooms. And then in the other room, you're going to find the utility terminal password. You're going to need both of these. You're going to come across this room. This room is going to let you drain the water from all the flooded rooms so you can go in there and do what you got to do. The other terminal, which is in this room, will let you disengage the lock to the overseer's room so you can finally get in that door. So here we are, roaming around, opening the door, which will lead you to here where the overseer is, but he's now ghoulified. Kill the ghoulified overseer. Once you kill him, you're going to notice there's a computer behind him. Get the password for that computer off his dead body and proceed to the next room. Overseer's password. How many passwords does this overseer have? Open armory door. Granted. Thank you. Which eventually leads you down to here where you'll be greeted by one ghoul who's super easy to kill. So you'll go through here and there will be this terminal. You'll have a couple of options. Send out an SOS, look at some logs, open the reactor door, close the external vents, and or reroute vault controls. I'm guessing if you close the vents, that will stop the radiation from poisoning the water pump and help uh, those NCR people in their farms or those farmers. But I tried to be Mr. Nice Guy and reroute the controls because of the message that you received that there's some people trapped in there and if you reroute the controls to them, they can now get out. So I was just trying to be a nice guy. Wasn't that nice to me? Which leads us to this last room right here around the corner. Takes us to this computer right here. We have two options, seal external vents like I was talking about that would probably help stop the radiation from getting to the farms and the water pump, but no, I chose reroute the controls because I'm a nice guy. And guess what? It backfired because once I got out of this room, those good people I tried to save were all ghoulified and they tried to kill me. And as you can see, if you choose more wisely than me, by closing those vents, you'll be able to stop the radiation and complete that quest. So I hope this helps you guys out there. Love Fallout, especially Fallout New Vegas. And you guys have yourself a good one. Peace.